different projects, different kinds, like things <laughs> from uh, projects that are supposed to be helping the environment to innovation, <laughs> innovational stuff, I guess, um, technologies or, you know, because this is where it starts before you get the next uh, Bill Gates, before you get the next Elon Musk, like it has to start here. So my expectations are roughly kind of everywhere. So when we've decided who wins, um, they go to the final. At the final, we do two things. We try to work out the top three projects of all the schools that follow a research, research methodology, as it were, STEM, research base. Then we have a different judging criteria. And in that judging criteria, we look at whether or not the technologies are commercializable. When we figure out that the projects are commercializable, we select five. Those projects go through to what we call a technical entrepreneurship workshop. It's a five-day camp. And then we fill the learners up to 25 so that they are all in business teams of five and we teach them business, um, business techniques using um, the business uh, model canvas. And they have to pitch at the end of the five days. Exciting process. Um, but for today, what we are doing is trying to work out who goes to the next step, which is the final, right? Wow, electricity, which basically means you can train electricity wirelessly. Uh, we're going to create an app which is going to be stored in cars, and the app is going to work again with the sensors to detect cars which are around you, so that you can know which cars are around you, not to overtake in how you want. I have identified a um, a problem which is drugs at schools. Then I have came with a solution which I'm gonna build a sensor which will detect illegal substances. In no particular order, I'm going to call the project number. Project number four is project number eight. It's project number 12. It's project number 17. It's project number 18. Project number 61. Project number 63, project number 65. 30, 